to you by Touch. Tricks, reviews, unboxed on you, and Hanson Mobile advertising on Facebook. Hello everybody and welcome back. Uh, today I am going to go over a few things <clears throat> that I've done that's actually kind of been new for me. Like I said before, I'm no longer going to do my videos like I did before in a like, tutorial kind of oriented uh, fashion. I'm just going to go through and show you guys, you know, what I've been doing and you know, where I'm at. I've been learning when it comes to audio and video though. So with that said, um, I'm going to let you guys see some of the progress I had. I uh, did another introduction video and ending video for a uh, game that I've been working on in the beginning of uh, the game page. Like I said, I do them separately. So Here I want to show you uh, my uh, visual text that I was able to work on. I started playing around with OneNote, which is on my Windows 8, and it comes with the programs to pull this off. So let me go ahead and show you guys what it looks like.
good, principled and scrupulous, selfish, unprincipled and anarchist, evil, miscreant, aberrant and diabolic. Alignments are an important factor in developing a character in the elements of role-playing. Whether we are consciously aware of That is um, what I've uh, got right there, and I will go over that here in a little bit. But there's a couple of other things that uh, I wanted to go over too, and it is in my, uh, my settings, I believe. Now, on um, on my uh, filters, filters. I actually came up with some pretty cool stuff, and now I did that on uh, my uh, video. Uh, is I came up with video text, came into my filters, and uh, I've got the noise gate, compressor, noise suppression, but. What I've got here is my uh, prop slash pad on my effects filter. I just tried to start that out. Down here you get that plus and you get all these options right here. Um, I'm working with the color correct. comes up like this. See, I do have that little bit of black right here in this area, but I'm okay with that, just as long as the birds come out. Now, the voice didn't come doing this on um, OBS. <clears throat> that came from my one note, and like I said, I'll show you guys about that here. Um, now, uh, on my video title on my introduction video you'll see how I uh, have the slideshow moving up and down how I did that was with color correction scroll now on my scroll what I did is I set vertical speed to 50.00 
I'm not quite sure if I had took the old background picture of the image that I had put it on there. Pretty sure. Keep it. 
this up and I can show after YouTube. So with that, I also came out with uh, my media source, which is the video, and I think it'll go through the introduction of the actual video that I put in between ending. So I'll go ahead and set that up. Okay. So we're 
just let it go. Pick the screen. Alignment by Kevin T. Ambita. The Alignment. Good, principled and scrupulous. Selfish, unprincipled and anarchist. Evil, miscreant, aberrant and diabolic. Alignments are an important factor in developing a character in the elements of role playing. Whether I 
I had to do is see uh, the tool that I'm, tools that I'm using. It's uh, the narrator. I've got a narrator on a computer that I could use, but for this one in particular, I had to use it because I'm doing a video on After the Bomb, and I loaded the website to show you. It's on Scribe. Now, um, Scribe, I have had to use a 30 day free trial to get this. Because after. Oh, well, it started telling me that I had to do a free trial. This is basically the setup. It's a PDF, so as you can tell right now, I'm copy paste. It doesn't the, the control C for So I did download it. This here. It is now in my files. So I have it in my after the bomb files and I'm download text. But this is off of my reader. Comes with the computer too. And I have this the same book as a, as a download for PDF. Alright, so now I actually Supposed to be. right here. Okay, this is where I'm at now. On here, and see, I can highlight. So, what I do, come in here, I highlight this, this is the option to copy, and up here on the left corner, I can go back to the other part in. So, Back out of there after I've uh, done that, and I have my one minute, which is right here. Is my attendance uh, to the dashboard. I'll show you what it does. I'm in here, right here. It's usually on your start menu as the uh, one minute. Can't find it there. Go to your apps by clicking that button now. It's right here under the one minute. I've got my one drive. Now those are two separate programs. Now, I've already got that, so I don't have to do, do it again. Get that in place and put my fit. This right here. See, I've already got this as a for root right here. This is the five. This one is a untitled one. Uh, I'll type in after the bomb. Rename page. Here, paste. That's right. Now on here you can't use your mouse to right click. Use it. Come in here and hit Control B. Do it like that. It's cheesy. Gives you the option to do server. So, what? Do here. 
too. It's one of those things that I have down here. zoomed up like that. If I use it for this right here, I can hit story. Like I said, I'm still getting used to so. Now I have all of that on here. And I have to go through and edit it. So I'm going to go through and edit it. This. This is right here. 
Jeez. somebody Set up. See what it's like. Get a female voice. You got a male voice. Sit play. The Palladium Experience Point System by Kevin C. Abita. Except in specially devised scenarios and tournaments, there is no winner in a role-playing game. The accumulation of heroic deeds, friends, prestige. Weapons, equipment, knowledge and skills can be construed to be the results of winning. If a character survives and meets with success in his endeavors, that is winning. However, there are rewards besides the acquisition of material goods and reputation, and those are developing your character's skills, knowledge, and abilities. That is how I get this right here. To the site that's got the PDF, I download and, and I open it with my reader. Take and pull everything on the reader. Yesterday I tried to do it and it didn't sync up like this, so I came up on here and it already But the one down here doesn't have these uh, options. You can do a bench reader to get to it, but I can sit it and then here. Capitalize first letters of sentences. 
is how we're gonna place ordinals first with set superscript, replace items with dash, and replace function half with fraction character half, things like that. So that is how I do that. After I am done with this, I come back into my OBS and down here I go into my uh, visual text. That's what I named it. You can name it anything else. It's actually the media source. I took my media source and I renamed it to in properties. I put the recording that I just made from the voice and everything in there. And after I put it in there, back out of it, here's filters. And I have effects filters down here at the bottom. The appearance of this is your audio and video filters. Good. Principles and scrupulous. Selfish. Unprincipled and ethicist. Evil. Misfiant. Aberrant. And diabolic. So you, you can go through and edit all of the words and stuff too. On You're on a deadline and you just need to get it out. You don't have to. And I did that. That's how I got uh, that added onto it. All I have to do is actually start it. So I showed you that just by itself. <clears throat> now I'm doing the media source with the visual text. And you'll see what it looks like. Now the audio is already on the video, so I, that's why this is mute. Because if it did, it would. But you don't have This is brought to you by the Franklin County Internet Gaming Society. Facebook and Roger Hansen. And with infamous on YouTube. The alignment. Good, principled, and scrupulous. Selfish, unprincipled, and anarchist. Evil, miscreant, aberrant, and diabolic. Alignments are an important factor in developing a character in the elements of role playing. Whether we are consciously aware of it or not, every person has his or her own code of ethics and morals, as well as a sense of justice and what constitutes good and evil, right and wrong. It is this sense of right and wrong that helps to build our moral fiber, mold our behavior, and dictate our reactions to people, events, and circumstances in the world. 
It is this code that makes the thought of stealing or hurting somebody abhorrent to one person, but acceptable to another. All players must choose an alignment for their character. Heroes most heroes will be of a good alignment, principled or scrupulous, anti-heroes and selfish characters with a heart of gold may be unprincipled, somebody who usually does the right thing in the end. These characters have a high regard for life, justice, and freedom. They will never, or rarely, intentionally take a life, even that of a villain, always try to uphold the law, and never betray their word of honor. These are the classic. Anti-heroes and vigilantes roguish heroes are usually best suited to the selfish alignment of unprincipled and an- Okay, I hope that was helpful to you. Videos as I want to show you the problems that are through because I don't it's just now starting to this. It seems interesting. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, share, make comments. We love feedback.